friends. Welcome back to Mindful Moments. Today's Mindful Moment focuses on clearing out negative self-talk. We will be practicing a visualization technique that is really great in helping to reduce the impact of negative thoughts or negative self-talk in any given situation. And we can uh, use this visualization technique at any time, any place. My name is Mariana, and I'm thrilled to be part of Mindful Moments and to share and uh, guide you through these segments. I also offer them in English and Spanish. So if you're interested in this Mindful Moment or any other one in Spanish, you can access it through the Mindful Moments directory online. Great, so let's get started. Of course, there are times in our lives, whether it's day-to-day -day life or in concentrated moments in our life in which our negative thoughts kind of um, take over and can feel overwhelming, um, making it for us, make, making it hard to focus maybe, um, hard to communicate what we're experiencing, what we're feeling, what we're thinking with others, and hard to choose another thought um, or rather to stop that thought and maybe change it into or transform it into a more positive um, thought. And so the technique today, visualization technique, is one way of you know creating an image in your mind an image for yourself that really helps to refocus and redirect that um, negative thought pattern or negative self-talk. Before we start, let's stretch. I always find it helpful um, when I've been sitting for a long time like I have today, um, doing spinal twists. So we're going to sit, um, remain seated, lengthen our spine, relax the shoulders, but kind of opening up at the chest, placing your fingertips on your shoulders and bringing up the elbows. Good, so you've got straight spine, elbows are out, shoulders are open, fingertips on the shoulder. And we're just gonna start with moving from one side to the other, let, you, let your neck move with you, your head move with you. And then we're going to introduce breathing to it. So as you move to one side, Inhale, and as you move to the other, you exhale, like this. We'll do one more. Good, and now just shake, shake the arms, shake the shoulders, shake the elbows and the wrists, kind of just release some tension. And if you've been typing and writing all day, this is a really good way to, to reset your arms, your wrists, your hands and release some tension. Great. Okay, so now bringing your focus back, bringing your attention back. Uh, take another deep breath, inhale. And exhale it all out. Ah, good. Now let's find a comfortable seated position wherever it is that we are, wherever it is that you are. If you can, if you're able to, feet flat on the ground, straight back, opening the shoulders again, relaxing. I always say strong, but not rigid. Strong yet relaxed. And just let your arms and your hands relax. Good. Okay, so now we're going to do a little bit of imagination. You can uh, lower your gaze if you like, relax the eyes, um, or you can watch me on the screen if you want to follow uh, what I'm doing. I'm just gonna be sitting here, I'll be speaking. So you can either just kind of lower the gaze or just in a very relaxed way looking at the screen. And recall a time when your thoughts were racing. Maybe where your thoughts were feeling just a little bit out of control. A little bit like this. Ah. Maybe your thoughts were about a situation or maybe your thoughts were about yourself. Negative self-talk. I can't do this. I won't pass this exam. Um, I will not, you know, get this X, Y, Z thing that you're waiting to get. 
Again, negative self-talk. So recall a time when your thoughts were in that direction and, and just kind of couldn't, couldn't quite get a hold on it, couldn't quite control them. Now, how did that make you feel? How did you feel? Not just at the time, but now as you're recalling. And how do you feel it in your body? Where in your body do you feel that? That racing thought, where else do you feel it in the body? I know I feel it in my heart. My heart goes do, 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 really fast. My hands sometimes shake too, kind of drop things and can't quite hold on to something, can't quite grip. What have you done in the past to redirect a particular racing thought or negative self-talk, negative self-messaging? What have you done in the past? Think about that. Now, returning to this memory or this moment with the negative self-talk or the racing thoughts, and bring that thought back because we're going to do something with it now. This is the technique that we're, we're learning today. Visualization technique. So return to that moment, return to that memory. And now imagine, really in your mind's eye, imagine a stop sign. And my, I go like this because mine's round, but yours can be any shape. Imagine a stop sign. Stop in big letters. Think about the color. Think about the shape, the location, and really make it big, make it a powerful stop sign because it's going to do some work. It's going to work. Okay. Now imagine those racing thoughts, those negative, that negative self-talk or, or negative thought patterns. Now bring them in, actually invite them in or the one thought, if it's the same one, bring it in and, and imagine as it's coming in and being stopped by that stop sign, like either you're holding it up or the stop sign just shows up, stop. And then that thought, imagine that thought vanish, just drop. Do it again. Same thought, different thought, stop. Vanish. Do that a few more times. Include in this process breathing. Breathe into it. Continue to breathe as you're imagining the thought. Stop sign. And you can even say the word stop. Or, you know, in your mind silently repeating it. As each thought pops up, it's stopped by the stop sign. Do one more. Thought, stop, vanish. Good, excellent. It's powerful. It has been for me. So notice, now let's just pay attention. Let's notice what, what do you feel in your body? How does that feel? When you think about this thought and, and then you, you kind of force it to stop you, and, and you have a visual and a word, stop. How does that feel? How, did, how was your breath? Were you breathing continuously? Were you aware? Did you hold your breath? I know I did a couple of times actually. And it's okay, you hold your breath and you become aware that you're holding your breath and you bring back the breath, return to the breath. Notice, how is that feeling in your jaw and your shoulders and your back? And this is, a, like I said, a powerful visualization. So here you have a tool and, and all of these are tools that we can use to redirect certain thought patterns, certain behaviors. 
And you can do this anytime, really any place. So now let's, do, let's close with some breathing. We're gonna do three deep inhales through the nose. We're gonna hold for just a couple seconds and then we're gonna breathe out through the mouth. Some cleansing, relaxing breaths. Inhale, hold, exhale through the mouth. Good, inhale, hold, exhale through the mouth. Last one, inhale, hold, exhale through the mouth. One long, deep exhale. Beautiful, beautiful. Okay, so let's place one hand on top of the other. I like to put my dominant hand on top of my less dominant hand so that my dominant hand can rest a bit, feel supported. Let's return to your natural breath. Breathing in and breathing out. And as I breathe out, I breathe out gratitude for all of you and sharing in this uh, mindful moment today, clearing out negative self-talk. And gratitude for the Mindful Moments crew and CPS and everybody else that has worked to make these possible. Thank you very much and see you next time.